boys and girls. So today we're going to look at letters and how they make names. So if you're looking here at my name, it says M R S period. And that says Mrs. Capital D U N C A N Duncan. So we're looking at letters today and how they make words. So as we're looking at these letters, we can see that some of our letters have sticks, tall sticks, and short sticks. Some of our letters have curves, tall sticks. We've got half circles, more half circles, little sticks, that form into the letters to make these different shapes. So you're gonna do the same thing with your name. So I wrote my name here in blue, and you could have mom and dad write it um, in a nice thin pencil or thin marker, and then you can even trace it. So if I were going to trace my name, I would um, make sure that I'm writing my letters correctly still. Going down, jumping over, tracing my S. I'm remembering that I'm holding my paper. I'm remembering to always start from the top. That wasn't my best work. If this was a dotted line, I would know to start um, at the fence for all of these, but they're just kind of on this big piece of paper. So you're going to either write your name or be tracing it right now. And then our goal is, is kind of like when you did the, um, the nature thing with your name, but now you're gonna maybe use inside crafty things for your name. So the next thing you're going to do is you're going to trace your name with glue. So mom and dad can help get it ready. Um, but whoops, you are just going to do it like you would your letters. You're going to trace and glue. Always start at the top. Go back down just like your letters are supposed to. Going to trace. And the purpose of this is we're going to decorate this. Usually when I have you in class, we get to use glitter. If you have glitter at your house, you can use glitter. But if you don't have glitter, you can use whatever else you can find that mom and dad says is okay. So you might be able to use um, beads. I, I grabbed some beads. I don't know if you can see that. Um, beads, I've got this little crate paper stuff and then I have glitter. Um, you could use sprinkles um, that you have for cookies. You could use tissue paper. You could use whatever you want. So I'm just going to glitter that and show you what um, that would look like if you had glitter. And then I'm going to use beads for the other part. Just so you can see, you can do different things. And the whole point is to be looking at our letters and see that letters make words, that the word, the M, R, and S is saying Mrs. And that the D-U-N-C-A-N is saying Duncan. And you can do your first name, making sure to capitalize it because you are a proper noun and proper nouns get capitalized because you are important. That's why your first letter in your name gets capitalized. So I can't wait to see what creations you come up with because your nature names were just beautiful. So go ahead and make your own name with things from inside the house and be creative. Take a picture of it and send it to your teacher and explain to them about how the letters in your name make words 
and why you used the different things that you used.